how's it going, everybody? I'm Devin, and we're back. Got ourselves a 2015 7600 SFA 6x4 with Allison Automatic. This is a uh, cement mixer. Woohoo! Yeah, cement mixer. Dirty one at that. All right, so today, uh, sometimes sensors don't work and whatnot, and you can see our uh, support arms for our chute bent. So we went ahead and cut them loose. Um, <clears throat> so, what we're going to do is, is we're going to jack up off the back of the machine here, put two plates down, go with a straight cylinder, and we're going to push it back up, bend it straight. All right, so one, one of the things to do, we're going to raise our machine. we got our truck on the machine. We're going to raise it up pretty high, okay, almost to the bottom. And uh, we're going to come over here. We cleaned off a spot on our frame here already. We're going to take our hook. Put it on here. Right. Like so. Okay. Man, we're gonna rig this up real short. We're just gonna use our clevis here. Slide it back. We're in line. We're gonna we're gonna hook some uh, clevises on here and tie it in real hard. Basically, no chain or anything. Alright, so one of the things I'm going to try and do here is try and get a little bit uh, better uh, view of some of this stuff that hooks up. Uh, I'm going to do a lot of high speed, but uh, try and do it slow speed this time. truck here has not been cleaned very well. We don't take very good care of these. Bam! Like that. Huh? Come on. There we go. So we're gonna do Jack this up. Got that fits in there. Okay. You have to move it over a little bit. Oh, she rose. That's that done. Locked in, ready to go. Got the old, uh... <sighs> Keep hitting my head, man. I'm gonna wind up being dumb all my life. Ah. Stuff gets moved around over here so much, I lose it. Lose my own stuff all the time. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get these uh, two short blades and we're gonna put two clevises on the back and then we're gonna stand them up and pin them off. So what we did was we got the two right here and we got them real close together. The clevises on. What we're gonna do is we're gonna put a plate here. 
Put a pusher right here on the center of this with a shim and then push straight up on it. All right, so on our cement mixer, here we go. Our cylinder, got a 20 ton cylinder right there. We got this little thing right here, screws in the bottom of it. Put it a long piece of pipe on. We got heavy wall pipe we put on there. Bam. Now, I can just find that piece of pipe. Hmm. It's like finding a needle in a haystack. All right, it's been a little while. Anyway, this is our uh, heavy wall that we put on there. We got multiple lengths of this stuff, you know, so that way we can uh, push, you know, long distances. All right, so here's what we got. Got a cylinder, we got a shim here, a shim plate. This is open in the middle to go over the bolt. Just like that, here we go. Don't do that. All right, so as you can see, she's up pretty far. It's about right where we need her. We're gonna cut the uh, support supports off and uh, put some new ones on there because those are bent. But uh, we're gonna get our chute loose here and uh, move it around and uh, drop the trailing arm here, push her axle and see what she looks like. Make sure she doesn't hit nothing. All right, so on our cement mixer here, some new pipes cut for our supports. Throw them down in here. Put it on right there. Weld her on up. Be good to go. Like the video subscribe thanks for uh, watching if you made it this far uh subscribe and uh that's another episode of bending with bending i'm bending and we'll see you later